बहुत तरक्की कर रही है हु विल टेल मी आंसर कैन आई आर यस स्टार्ट समीरा बहुत तरक्की कर रही है अर्चना मैम टेल मी आंसर Uh, tense is is continuous tense and sentence is, Samira is making great progress. Samira is making great progress. Great, great progress. Very good. All of you are correct. Okay. Correct. Next, uh, any one of you, uh, Harshit, Archana, ma'am, please tell me the next one. एक घंटे से घंटे से परम आपको कुछ जरूरी बात करने की कोशिश कर रहा है प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट कॉन्टिन्यूस टेंस में परम हैज बीन ट्राइंग टॉक टू यू सम इम्पोर्टेंट मैटर सिंस वन वन आवर यू कुड नॉट अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट द डिफरेंस अबाउट हाउ टू यूज सिंस एंड फॉर हर शेप यू आर स्टिल कंफ्यूज I have to take a class of that one again. I think. Okay, Archana, tell me, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, please uh, tell me. The sentence is uh, present perfect continuous, and uh, it's translated as Param has been trying to important discussion with you for an hour. Okay, Karan, your answer. Yeah, ma'am. The tense form is present, present perfect continuous, and uh, the tense and the uh, oh. sentence is param has, param has, sorry, param have been, yeah, param has been trying to tell, trying to tell you some important things for one hour, one hour hour. Yes, correct. Param has been trying to tell you something important. something important for one hour one for one hour please write down all of you harshit write down and read it again param has been trying talk to you some important matter for one hour trying to talk trying to talk yes i am trying to talk hmm trying param has been trying hmm. to talk you some important matter for one hour हम्म 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 वेरी गुड यस फॉर वन आवर ओके करेक्ट नेक्स्ट अर्चना मैम प्लीज टेल मी द नेक्स्ट ट्रांसफॉर्म एंड आंसर बाहर कुछ लोग गप्पे मार रहे थे टेंस इज पास इम्पोर्टेंट पास पास कंटिन्यूस टेंस यस कंटिन्यूस हम्म एंड सेंटेंस इज सम पीपल वर गॉसिपिंग आउटसाइड Uh, Karan, Harshit, tell me your answers. Okay, man. Bahar kuch log gappe mar rahe the. The tense form is present continuous, and the sentence is some people are gossiping outside. Kar rahe the. It is past continuous, Karan. Rahe the. Rahe hai nahi. It is rahe the. The will be. The tha. These all are past. I'm sorry, man. I wrote. Yeah, no, you can't play. Correct it. Hey. Okay, ma'am. Yeah. Kar rahe the. Okay. So, so the sentence. Kar rahe the. So the sentence is: Some people were gossiping outside. Were gossiping outside. Okay. Harshit, tell me. Hmm. Shayad kuch log bahar gappe maar rahe the. It is in past continuous tense. Maybe some people were gossiping outside. There will be no maybe. Some people, yeah. some people, some people, or some persons, some persons were making gossips Gossip. or gossiping. Gossiping, you can say gossiping outside. Some people. It is correct. 
Yes. Means my sentence is correct. Yes. Yeah. Some people were gossiping outside. And uh, Archana, ma'am, your sentence is also correct. Very good. You are uh, getting to understand what's the tense form, and that is very very good news for your uh, learning languages. It is really very important to know the time form of the sentence, and you can make it easily. There will be no no hesitation to make the sentence, translate the sentence. Okay, next, uh, Karan, tell me. Shayad uski ma usse lodi suna chuki hogi. Okay, ma'am. So, the tense form it is future perfect, and the sentence is maybe his mother, maybe his mother will have sung a song for him. There will be no maybe. There will be. Shayad means perhaps. Perhaps. Shayad means perhaps. P e r h a p s. Perhaps. Perhaps. His mother yeah. will have will have made him made him, will have made him listen made him listen some uh, some uh, lori lori means what song okay lori means uh, uh, children song child song kid song like that. Perhaps her mother will have made her listen some some song. Did you write? Yes, ma'am. Okay, okay, very good. So, uh, next, uh, Harshit, tell me the next one. मॉर्निंग कम आफ्टर इवनिंग Morning comes. Okay, ma'am comes. Morning comes after evening. Hmm. Okay, Archana, ma'am, tell me what's your sentence? Yes, ma'am. Morning comes after evening. Yes, very good. Archana, ma'am, now you tell me the next one. Yes, ma'am. Bachchan sahab kaafi samay se mera istar ka rutba banaye hue hain. The tense is for being perfect continuous tense, and in sentence is. बच्चन साहब है समय से मेगा स्टार का रुतबा बनाए हुए हैं बच्चन साहब हैज बीन मेकिंग ओके करण टेल मी ओके मैम सो सेंटेंस इज बच्चन साहब काफी समय से मेगा स्टार का रुतवा बनाए हुए हैं द टेंस फॉर्म इज प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट कॉन्टिन्यूस एंड द सेंटेंस इज बच्चन सर हैज बीन मेंटेनिंग दे आर मेगा स्टार प्रोफेशन फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम दे आर नो दे आर इज नॉट देयर दे आर विल बी नॉट कमिंग But uh, uh, Archana, ma'am, what did you say? Uh, say very slowly, Bachchan sir. Uh, Bachchan sir has been maintaining. Has been yes. Me- yes. Uh, the status of uh, status of mega star has been maintaining. Yes. What you told again, sir? The status of mega star for a long time. Yes, Bachchan sir has been maintaining the status of mega star. For a long time, please write down. Yeah, no. Complete, complete, Harshit. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, please tell me. Please tell me answer. Bachchan, 
Bachchan sir has been maintaining the status of mega star for a long time. Very good, very good. In my sentence, Bachchan sir has been maintaining the status of mega star for a long time. Yes, yes, correct. Now, uh, Karan, your turn to say the next. Okay, ma'am. So the so the one last one is. Abhi abhi, aapko ek tofa milega. The tense form is future simple, and the sentence is. You will get the gift now. Achana, ma'am, tell me your sentence. You will get a gift right now. You will get a gift right now. Harshi, tell me your answer. Yeah, ma'am, it is a future simple tense, and you will get a gift right now. Yes, correct. And Karan, what did you say? You will. You will get a gift now. Uh, right now, you will get a gift right now. Abhi abhi, right now, abhi abhi. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. Very good. Great explanation. Great tense form, time time forms you have known very well, very well. I want to I want to uh, continue this time form of uh, taking the translations daily so that you can get the idea and there will be no. Uh, I think uh, no. incorrection incorrect things uh, that you are confused and all every day if you are doing 10 10 12 time forms and sentences translations that will be enough for you to understand the grammar very very easily and i think uh, it is the most easiest time it is easiest way to make you understand otherwise uh, so many classes are there so many things are there without without doing translations within this way uh you can't understand it is it you will be predicted it is a very very what uh, difficult thing but it is not like that you can see now grammar to learn grammar to translate these words and to know grammar is really very easy